Well, let's take the situation that we were talking about before about uh, getting credit. So, you know, if we're, we're getting credit for an automobile, all right? So let's say that, you know, it becomes difficult for me because of the reasons you said. Can I dismiss my 13 and then refile it? You and can. And include that automobile. That before was post-petition. Yes, if you dismiss your case and then refile, you are basically starting over. That new filing date controls. However, if you have a case dismissed within a year of refiling, then you must bring a motion to extend the automatic stay to get the full bankruptcy protection. Within how long? If a case is dismissed within one year of filing a second case, you have to bring a motion to extend the automatic stay, otherwise that stay expires after 30 days. Some judges have, have felt that it extends to, uh, the stay applies to the bankruptcy estate. Others have said it only applies to the debtor personally and not to the property. So you want to be very careful about dismissing and refiling. Plus you have another filing fee, another 341 meeting, another confirmation hearing. So it's just starting all over again, uh, but it, you know, it, in, in some circumstances it, it, it might be advisable. That's why each situation is different and you need to talk to somebody who can help you out there.